to the channel. What's up, guys? Oface here and back with another episode of Walking Dead trailers. We are going on the third and final trailer so far that has come out. Um, there are four, so I shouldn't have ended that with final, but we are going to go ahead and jump into this third trailer and uh, see if they leave any more light for us, you know? Give us give us a glimpse of what this game is going to be about. Uh, again, for those of you that haven't watched any of the previous videos, the new Walking Dead game is made by Overkill. It uh, appears to be a four-person FPS game, similar to The Division, but apparently... Your choices will, in fact, influence the game in ways. Uh, that has been yet to be fully explained. Hopefully, uh, we can get a clearer idea the farther we go along with this. And uh, let's go ahead and jump into this trailer. I know you guys are pretty excited about this. Again, this trailer may contain content that is inappropriate for children. Um... That being said, if they see it, that's your fault. <laughs> Just kidding, guys, but yeah. Again, Overkill, Skybound, 505 Games. All good companies. Great companies make good games. Let's see. Ah, this was the Rick lookalike. I remember. I remember. First video. Gave a glimpse of him, and I was like, is that Rick waking up out of the bed? You know, the way Walking Dead's been going wouldn't surprise me at all. Would not surprise me at all if they threw him in on a video game. I love that sound, that tin sound. I don't know if you guys can really hear it. The thunder, all of it sounds great on this Razer Man of War headset. Yeah. It's my kind of guy. Probably plays him, I can already tell. I can already tell. I got a granddaughter who likes dressing up too. Cute as a button. She loves Peter Pan. Oh. <laughs> she always asking awesome. this old timer to read it to her. Oh wow. She's wow. Sharp as a tack. You talk about killing Boy, Call of Duty zombies. Look at about that. The lost boys the and those pirates. Probably because because yeah. I never grow old. That's typical. Yep. Old broken ankle coming. She says to me, Grandpa, are you old? An old drunk. <laughs> My God. Yes, sweetheart, I'm old. And one I think day he'll, you're going to be as old as he'll, me. He'll, he'll, he'll definitely be who I play as. I can tell. Cooking, I says, can tell. Grandpa, are you going to die? Hmm. And I say, yes, sweetheart. Of course I'm going to die one day. Well, it's not going to be today. <laughs> awesome. Awesome. This is... Finally, got some anticlimaticness to, to it, Grandpa. Am I gonna die? Ooh, that. Oh, how do you explain a question like that to question. a kid? So when Halloween rolls around the next year, there she is, proud as punch. She stands up, and she goes, Grandpa, wow. I'm gonna be a pirate. Nice, nice. Sea of Thieves. Sea of Thieves. This one's not as action-packed as all the others, though, I will say. Well, that... He drew a little bit of attention to himself there. Don't you worry, sweetheart. I'll find you. I promise. Okay. Okay. That makes a little more sense. And a horde comes. Nice. Okay. Okay. It's coming soon, guys. It's the fall. Fall. Right around the corner. Alright, guys. We just got another look into The Walking Dead. And, and so far, I've got to say, this one actually has a little more story added to it. Perhaps something more 
as uh, I guess I would say all the other trailers have really had a good backstory to them, but this is the first story I've seen that actually shows it going forward. He is searching for his granddaughter. Uh, all the other ones, as I've said, they've showed like you had the nurse, showed her shooting the doctor, then you had uh, the first guy who was in Washington, looked like some kind of federal worker, and then it was Apocalypse, and now he was a shooter going around, you know, getting zombies and whatnot. This one, not so much action, but as I said, more foreshadowing. I'm pretty excited. Um, I, I'm looking forward to this game. I'm now seeing, apparently, if you do play as him, you do have some objectives of finding your granddaughter, and I'm assuming based on how Walking Dead works, that she's probably already passed. But, who knows? Who knows? This is gonna be, this is gonna be a good game. Exciting times, exciting times. There's not many games coming out this year that I'm overly excited about. Most of the ones I like are coming out in 2019, 2020, 20. Um, but this one, this one's on my list. I'll definitely have it. This along with uh, Detroit Becoming Human. For PS4 that one also looks really good and we will go over a gameplay of that in my next video we'll go ahead and hit up the demos and um, we'll really see how that leads us and uh, where it takes us but uh, again I will continue to provide more videos about the Walking Dead video game by Overkill uh, as soon as they come out as soon as they start releasing we'll really start going over it as well as uh, Anticipating the release of the fourth video here soon if not at E3 That wouldn't surprise me one bit if they actually brought it to E3 so uh, We'll see how it goes. I also believe when E3 happens. We're gonna go ahead and shoot a full video going over all of the uh, highlights and everything interesting uh, maybe we'll see some good games come out this year. I highly doubt they'll be this year if they're at E3. They'll probably be next year. But again, that's where we're at. And uh, anyways, guys, this was a short one today, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, as always, feel free to like, subscribe, and share. Remember, sharing is caring. And as always, guys, if you're going to get them, get them in the face. Right.